1968, W.P. Clark Sr., Group Chairman, decided to move Wall Colmenoy's manufacturing and business HQ to Wales. He'd been impressed with the potential employee pool, their work ethic, education and background in engineering and especially metallurgy. Today, the company is a European and world leader in high temperature brazing, surface engineering using nickel-based alloys, and as cast and machine components, manufactured by precision investment, spin and sand castings. It also supplies specialist metallurgical services, deploying vacuum and other protective atmosphere furnaces. These products and services are used to supply many industries as diverse as power generation, aerospace, defence, oil and gas exploration, food production and transport. Abrasing alloys are used throughout the world, for example in the manufacture of exhaust gas recyclers and catalytic converters, used by many of the world's leading car manufacturers. Occupying nearly 90,000 square feet of factory space and other facilities, the business provides employment to a well-trained workforce of skilled tradespeople, graduate and higher degree metallurgists and engineers. Training and apprenticeship schemes have secured a continual flow of talent to support the growing business. The company works closely with the universities of Swansea, Cardiff and Aachen in Germany in problem solving and product development. More than 80% of the company's products and services are sold outside the UK and business is conducted in all major EU languages. The Wall Colmenoy business, founded in a unique range of nickel alloys, is a key product to many diverse engineering parts and processes used in high-end technology industries such as aerospace and Formula One racing cars. Inert gas and water atomizing are used to manufacture these alloys as fine powders, which in turn are used for surface engineering or high temperature brazing. Carefully balanced feedstock metals and alloys are made into charges which are loaded into induction melting furnaces. Heated to temperatures exceeding 1000 degrees Celsius, these charges become molten alloys and are poured through a jetting system at the top of a large tank. A finely divided molten droplet stream results, which is collected as powder when cold. The powder is then sieved to the appropriate particle size range for each application. Each batch of powder is carefully tested for chemical analysis and physical properties before being released for sale. Many alloys are made to meet customised applications and specifications. These same alloys can also be made into castings, using either the spin, lost wax or sand casting methods. In this case, the molten metal is poured from the induction furnace into a mould made by the so-called lost wax or precision investment process. The items to be manufactured are firstly moulded with a special wax. These are then attached to a wax feeder system. The resultant assembly is dipped and then coated with a ceramic powder capable of withstanding very high temperatures. The wax is then removed from the ceramics and the empty mould filled with molten metal. Sand moulds are manufactured on site and are used to produce the larger components we supply. The parts made by these processes are often machined to very fine dimensional and surface tolerances down to micron sizes. We have modern sophisticated CNC or computer numerical control systems which are specially designed to machine nickel and cobalt alloys. The material removed is routinely collected and recycled, as is a vast proportion of our waste product. We are justifiably proud of our ongoing recycling and environmental policies, helping to ensure that we are a truly environmentally responsible company.
many of these high precision parts that we machine are used in industries as diverse as packaging, food processing and steel manufacture, and also in the glass industry, for example, in the manufacture of bottles and jars. Chemical analysis and other physical properties such as hardness are measured as part of quality assurance. The dimensions of the parts are also verified using computer-controlled coordinate measuring machines. Wall Colmanoi were pioneers in using vacuum and other protective atmosphere furnace technology for high temperature brazing and other thermal processes. In a typical furnace brazing, nicro-braze alloy is used to coat parts which are then assembled and brazed to produce high integrity components such as pressure reducers for the gas and oil industries. The furnaces complement other services, such as high-velocity oxy-fuel spraying, and are deployed as part of a subcontract service to many leading UK companies. The largest diameter vacuum furnace within the EU is located at Ponta Dowie. This specialised know-how is often sought for niche applications especially in the overhaul of gas turbine parts for land and aircraft applications. As well as manufacturing new components, Wall Colmanoi also provides repair and overhaul processing to numerous prestigious UK-based customers, providing cost-effective, environmentally friendly solutions to help keep the UK on the move. With our highly trained and motivated workforce, technical expertise and commitment to the future, Wall Colmanoi is proud to be working in Wales, supplying to the world.